ओम ज्ञातिरंध से ज्ञानजन शैलाकया चक्षुन्मील जैन तस्म श्रीगुरभे नम श्रीचैतन्य मनोभीष्ट स्थापित जन भूत स्वयं कदा ददाती स्वदातीक वंदे अहं श्रीगुरो श्रीजुतापदकम श्रीगुरून वैष्णवांश श्रीरूप साग्रजात सह गण रघुनाथ तं सजीव साइत सवधूत परिजन सहित कृष्ण चैतन्यदेव श्रीराधाकृष्णपदागण ललिता श्री विशखा निता नमो ओं विष्णुपदाय कृष्ण पृष्ठा भूतले श्रीमते भक्ति वेदात स्वामीनी नमिने नमस्ते सारस्वते देवे गौरवाणी प्रचारिणे निर्विशेष शून्यवादी पाश्चातरिणे नम महाबदन्याय कृष्ण प्रेम प्रदायते कृष्णाय कृष्ण चैतन्य नमिने गौरतिशे नम हे कृष्ण करुणा सिंधु दीनबंधु जगत्पते गोपेश गोपिका का राधाकांत नमस्तुते तप्त कांचन गौरांगी राधे वृंदावनेश्वरी वृषभानुसुते देवी प्रणमा हरि प्रिय वंशा कल्पतरूभ्य कृपा सिंधुभे पतिता पावनेभ्यो वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नमः श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु निनंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर शिवासादी गौरभक्तवृंद हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे सो रीडिंग फ्रॉम श्रीमद भगवद गीता एज इट इज थर्ड चैप्टर कर्मजोग टू द टेक्स्ट नाइन जज्ञाथा कर्मण अन्यत्र लोक अयम कर्मबंधन तदर्थ कर्म कौंतेय मुक्त समाचर वार्ड मीनिंग जज्ञाथात डॉन ओनली फॉर द सेक ऑफ यज्ञ और विष्णु कर्मण देन वार्क अन्यत्र अदरवाइज लोक वर्ल्ड अयम दिस कर्मबंधन बंडेज बाय वर्क तत् ऑफ हिम अर्थम फॉर द सेक कर्म वर्क कौंतेय ओ सन ऑफ कुंती मुक्त संघ लिबरेटेड फ्रॉम एसोसिएशन समाचर डू परफेक्टली ट्रांसलेशन एंड पार्पोर्ट बाय डिवाइन ग्रेस अभय चरण अरविंद भक्ति वेदांत स्वामी शिल प्रभुपाद शिल प्रभुपाद की जय ट्रांसलेशन वर्क डन एज ए सेक्रीफाइस फॉर विष्णु हैज टू बी परफॉर्म्ड otherwise work ajes bandage in this material world therefore o son of kunti perform your prescribed duties for his satisfaction 
and in that way you will always remain free from bondage please repeat work done as a sacrifice for vishnu has to be performed otherwise work causes bondage in this material world therefore osana kunti perform your prescribed duties for his satisfaction and in that way you will always remain free from bondage purport since one has to work even for the simple maintenance of the body the prescribed duties for a particular social position and quality are so made that purpose can be fulfilled jagya means lord vishnu or sacrificial performances all sacrificial performances also are meant for the satisfaction of lord vishnu the vedas enjoin jagya vai purushah in other words the same purpose is served whether one performs prescribed jagyas or directly serves lord vishnu krishna consciousness is there for perform performance of jagya as it is prescribed in this verse the varna ashram institution also aims at satisfying lord vishnu varna ashram chara vrata purushena parapuman vishnu aradhyate pantha vishnu pran 388 therefore one has to work for the satisfaction of vishnu any other work done in this material world will be a cause of bondage for both good and evil work have their reactions and any reactions uh, any reaction binds the uh, performer therefore one has to work in in krishna consciousness to satisfy krishna or vishnu and while performing such activities one is in a liberated stage this is the great art of doing work and in the beginning this process requires very expert guidance one should therefore act very diligently under the expert guidance of a devotee of lord krishna or under the direction uh, instruction of lord krishna himself under whom arjuna had the opportunity to work nothing should be performed for sense gratification but everything should be done for the satisfaction of krishna this practice will not only save one from the reaction of work but also gradually elevate one to transcendental loving service of the lord which alone can raise one to the kingdom of god hare krishna जज्ञाथा कर्मण अन्यत्र लोकयम कर्म बंधन तदर्थम कर्म कौंते मुक्त संग सचर वर्क डन एज ए सेक्रिफाइस फॉर विष्णु हेज टू बी पर्फम अदरवाइज वर्क अज एस बंडेज इन दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड दे आर फॉर ओ सन ऑफ कुंती पर्फम युअर प्रेस्क्राइब ड्यूटीज फॉर दिस सैटिस्फेक्शन एंड इन दैट वे you will always remain free from bondage so in end of second chapter krishna spoke about sthita pragya the simple the different symptoms of a person who is perfectly situated in knowledge and then he also told that you stay in this in this particular stage in a self relation and you work but this is the perfection of life to come to the stage of this brahma bhuta stage or to this uh, uh, sthita pragya stage then arjuna was thinking then if this uh, this stage is perfect and if he is uh, someone come to in knowledge to this perfectional stage then what is need of working why you, you are a, engaging me in in this uh, work again so that's why krishna again speaking in detail what is the uh, what is karma jago and why one has to work as in previous verse is told that 
one cannot even maintain this body without working. Even, uh, that Krishna is telling that. And in that way, Sarira Jatra Pichate Prasidhyati Akarmanaha. One cannot even maintain one's physical body without work. So, one has to work. Karman, karman, uh, karmanya, karmanya japasyad, karmanya jah karma, so buddhiman manusyas. Krishna will tell in a, a forthcoming verses in a fourth chapter. Even. So, Krishna has to, ne, he is an intelligent person who sees, who is a, someone is working when he is outwardly seeing that he is not working. He is just sitting here. Eh? And that someone is, uh, uh, if uh, he is in, in, and someone sees that uh, someone is doing karma, but still he is not doing any karma. He is not subject to any reaction. So in this way, uh, here is Krishna is advising to Arjuna that uh, jagyarthat karma. One has to work for satisfaction of Lord. Vishnu. Anyatra lokayam karma bandhana, otherwise he will be in this cycle, he will in this bondage of karma, reaction of karma, and he is subject to again the birth and death, in the cycle of this birth and death again. So we see in this Mahabharata war, they are standing, both war, armies are standing, one side is Pandava's army, another side is Kaurava's army, and Jyotisar, this, uh, this, this. So in, the, in between these two armies, this Krishna Arjuna, the chariot is standing there, there and Krishna and Arjuna, the speaking is going on. So there is two, part, two, two parties. One party is doing karma for satisfaction of Vishnu, Jagyartha. Who is that party? Pandavas. Pandavas doing karma for satisfaction of eh, Vishnu. Otherwise, Yudhishthira Maharaj no desire to become emperor of the eh, world. He has no such de desire. He is only to satisfy Krishna, Pandavas are in this war. And the other, other side is not according to desire of Krishna. Jagyartha karma. One party is doing jagya, karma for jagya, for satisfaction of Vishnu, for Krishna. And other party, just for their own satisfaction, even Krishna try to stop them, not to in, uh, engage in this... Eh? This uh, work of destruction or uh, this, uh, this war, even he went himself as a messenger to Durjadhan, eh? to, to the Kauravas. Even he gave this message to, to Dhutrashtra and all the, all these, uh, in that Kaurava assembly, everyone, all the elderly people were there. And Durjadhan was even, eh? tried to arrest whom? Krishna. Eh? Even Krishna saw his Vishwarup, his uh, universal form, but he thought this is only some music or something, some magic or something. He has not surrendered. Eh? So if one do a work like that Kaurava just did, they, they, are, they are, both are doing work, fighting, they engaged in fighting, Kauravas and Pandavas. But there is difference. Once the Pandavas are engaged in fighting for satisfaction of Krishna, and other, other side, they are engaged, they are also in war, but opposing Krishna's desire. Eh? They are, uh, so this is, uh, we have to uh, do our work, but for the satisfaction of Krishna. Jagyarthat karmano, anyatra lokayam karma bandhana. Otherwise, we will be in bandha, in a, again in this karma bandhana, in bandage. So, Srila Prabhupada is uh, making in this point in this purport also about Varnasrama Dharma. This Varnasrama, this is a, in Varnasrama quoting the verse from Vishnu Purana telling Varnasrama Charavrata Purusena Parapuman Vishnu Aradhyata Pantha Nanyata Tosakarina. So Varnasrama even, Varnasrama Dharma, but the goal of Varnasrama Dharma is to satisfy Vishnu. Any karma we are doing, the point is that we can do karma, but this karma must be for the satisfaction of 
Vishnu. Otherwise, uh, if we'll do such karma for our own sense, sense gratification, then we'll be again in the cycle of birth and death. But we same karma, if we'll do only for the satisfaction of Vishnu. Even Krishna told to Arjuna in the end of Bhagavad Gita, in the uh, 18th chapter, eh? Mat chita sarva durgaani mat saris mat prasada tarishyasi atha chetta ahankaravna swasyasi binankhyasi. Even Krishna told, eh? very bold word. Eh? Eh? If you fix your mind at my feet, mat chita sarva durgaani, you will be uh, overcome all types of uh, hindrances in this, uh, in the path of your work. Otherwise, if you will not follow me, you will act whimsically, then you will get destroyed. Eh? So, you will get destroyed. Eh? You will be doomed. So, that's why it is, uh, even this Varna Ashrama, that is, in, even the last days, Prabhupada was talking about Varna Ashrama, Dharma. But the goal of Varna Ashrama must be to satisfy Lord Vishnu. Eh? Vishnu Aradhyate Pantha. But in Chaitanya Chaitamati, even Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami told, Chara Varna Ashrami Jadi, uh, Chara Varna Ashrami, uh, Swadharma, uh, Swadharma, uh, if the four, four types of orders, like Brahmachari, Grahastha, Banaprastha, Sanyasi, or Brahman, Khetri, Vaishya, Sana, uh, Vaishya, Sudra, even Chara Varna Ashrami, um, uh, if they are following their own Swadharma, their own principles according to Varna Ashram, perfectly. But if they are not doing Krishna Bhajan, if you are not doing Bhajan, eh, Krishna, then they are not in the proper situation. Eh? Krishna, I am not remembering the particular verse. Uh, Sodharma uh, achari le raurave padi maje. Even if this person in Varnasram is perfectly following these principles. But if he will not uh, doing Krishna bhajan, if he will not uh, uh, acting according to satisfy Krishna, then he will be a candidate for the hell. Eh? Hell is planet. One has to, that's why Bhakti Vinod Thakur used to say, Griye thaka, bane thaka, Huh? Sada Hari Bole Dako. That is the Jagya for this age. Huh? The, what is the Jagya? Jagya Sankirtana Prayeri Jajantihi Sumedhasa. It's one, if the most intelligent person in this, in this age of Kali, they engaged in chanting the holy name of the Lord. Whether he is Brahmana, Khetriya, Vaishya or Sudra, or Brahma, he is a Sanyasi or Banaprastha or in Grahastha or Brahmachari. The real thing is to chant Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. So Krishna is telling one has to do everything, all his work only for the satisfaction of Lord Vishnu. Jagyarthat Karmano. Only to satisfy Lord Vishnu one has to act. Uh, for this Kali Yuga, this one has to uh, how we want satisfy to Lord Vishnu? Huh? How can we satisfy Lord Vishnu in this age? By chanting the holy name of the Lord. Huh? Krishna Varna Trisa Krishna Sangha Panga Astra Parsadam Jagya Sankirtana Prayer Jajantihi Sumedasa. The most intelligent person in this age of Kali, they accept this Sankirtana Jagya that is started by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He is Krishna. But his, uh, his uh, color in this age, he is not appeared as a blackish. Eh? Tisa or Krishna. He is with his Sangha, with, uh, with his Advaita, and, and with his Nityananda Advaita, and Gada, Sangha Upanga, eh? Adv and Gadadhara and Srivas, Sangha Panga Astra. He is a uh, weapon. Goswami, according to Jiva Goswami, his, his uh, excellent, beautiful feature is his. One is a weapon. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is extremely beautiful because uh, the Radha Bhava Duty. He is accepted as Radharani's uh, mood and also his co the color of Radharani. So, 
is very beautiful by anyone just seeing chaitanya mahaprabhu automatically they attracted to him but same time prabhupada used to say this narayana astra this hari krishna mahamantra is also in his hand this is narayana astra jare pad hari krishna hari krishna 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 hari 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 ram hari ram 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 sang pang astra parshadam and all the gaur bhakta vrinda jagya sankirtana prayer so mahaprabhu himself apani achari prabhu jibere sikhay in this age of kali so chaitanya mahaprabhu himself he is a, wherever it be, he he was visited he just <coughs> asked the people to chant hare krishna mahamantra eh? he to just engaged in this jagya one time in andhra pradesh there was a for a long time there was no there no not raining so this uh, the, there is shortage of water eh? even people could not get water for, for drinking eh? perfect what is to speak about taking bath or all these things there is in a life uh, science of self relation proper wrote one article then this uh, the governor of uh, the andhra pradesh and the they wrote a letter to sila prabhupada swami ji you have such a big inst- uh, international organi- organization so other organizations in our country like ramkrishna mission or divine life society and the bharat swak sevak samaj all this they are doing their best helping us eh, by distributing water or food and medicine and clothes for the suffering peoples so we have to do something you have such a organ such a huge organization worldwide organization so prabhupada immediately wrote the letter eh? yes we have this we have a food for life or something we can distribute little uh, service but this is not the ultimate solution for the problem you must know what is the cause of this uh, this uh, uh, suffering because there is main thing is there is no raining that's why everything is uh, you are suffering so you should find some way to make raining so that's why uh, prabhupada quote jag in the from fourth chapter of gita eh uh jagya ne ah jagya ne wo subha annad bhavati bhuta annad bhavati bhutani parjanyat arna sambhav so prabhupada told parjanyat arna sambhav eh if it is parjan this if it raining will go they will go rain is come then it is be nice sufficient raining then all your water problem will be solved and everything your food problem or everything will gradually will solved so you have to perform this sankirtan jagya in this age to satisfy you have to satisfy lord vishnu or krishna unless you satisfy vishnu or krishna your problem will not solve this is the root cause they have to solve the problem you have to satisfy vishnu that's why you have to do jagya and this for this age the jagya is recommended sankirtan jagya so in your in your state you have to organize big sankirtan parties in every village you so our devotees will go is can devotees they can guide them how to do sankirtan start sankirtan how to do sankirtan how to chant mantra but your peoples must cooperate cooperate them eh? so when there will be congregational chanting everywhere then a sudden definitely there will be raining proper told even we have experiment this in calcutta eh? when there no long time there was no raining when our devotees went in, in the street for a sankirtan then immediately he eh? raining uh, the rain is come and there is a huge raining so problem will solve like this so you have to in a, any situation whether it is be small problem or big problem we have to satisfy lord vishnu so start to satisfy lord vishnu for this for this dwapar yuga that is this uh, their yuga dharma is different or particularly this uh, war situation pandavas they are also satisfy trying their best to satisfy krishna by following his instructions whatever krishna is taking they are fully depend on krishna <coughs> so but in uh, for our situation in this situation we have to follow this 
example that how to satisfy Lord Vishnu. Eh? Whether he is in any burner or any ashram or in any situation, we have no, we have nothing to satisfy Lord Vishnu. We have no others. Eh? There is no other way, no other way, no other way. Eh? Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Hare Rama. Iba kevalam kalo naaste iba, naaste iba, naaste iba gati ranya tha. There is no other way. So. Jagyarthat karmano anyatra lokoyam karma bandhana. That's why we have to work for satisfaction of Lord Vishnu. In Parpati Nayan, Prabhupada is telling how to satisfy Lord Vishnu, how to start this jagya. One has to work under a proper guidance. One must take guidance from a, from a devotee. Prabhupada wrote, one has to take guidance from a devotee. How to work? He will tend up you according to your nature. Because in this age of Kali, there is not any caste will not recognized according to his birth. Kalau eh? Sudra Sambhava. According to Kali Yuga, everyone is by birth is Sudra. Sanskare Dija Uchyate, Veda Pathet Bhavad Vipra, Brahma Janati Iti, Brahmana. So, Prabhupada wrote in Parpat that one has to act according to proper guidance. Eh? This is a great, great art of doing work. And in the beginning, this process requires very expert guidance. One should uh, uh, therefore act very diligently under the expert guidance of a devotee of Lord Krishna. Eh? That means Srila Prabhupada, he was expertly guiding this moment. Eh? And for his disciples, he was expert, expertly guiding them, understanding their nature. And according to nature, who is fit for which seva, which work, Prabhupada is very perfect. He perfectly engaged the disciple in particular, particular seva, then he is satisfied and eh? also work enthusiastically. So this is Prabhupada's given, uh, writing in purport. How to, serve, how to satisfy Lord Vishnu? Eh? One has to learn from, from a, a perfect spiritual master. From a spiritual master or a perfect devotee of Krishna, one has to learn this. Eh? Is you have to learn this. Tadvidhi pranipatena pari prasnena sevaya upadekhyantite jnanam jnanina tatudarsina. One has to uh, very uh, submissively, eh? Sorry, uh, very, uh, with a meek and humble mood, you have to ask. And according to the guidance of a perfect devotee, one has to act. Then he could satisfy Lord Vishnu. So, this Prabhupada make another point in his purport, in, in his, in his purport that one has to work under the able guidance of a eh, perfect devotee. Then Prabhupada told even Arjuna worked, but he acted according to direct guidance of Krishna. One has to, must take some guidance, either Krishna or Krishna's representative. Arjuna was fortunate, he was uh, directly acting under the guidance of Krishna. But for us, we must act according to the guidance of spiritual master. He is representative of Krishna. Eh? We must know how to satisfy Krishna. Eh? Every individual has their different natures, according to their natures. Prakruti kriyamanani gunai karmani sarvasa ahankara vimudatma karta ahangmiti manyate. So, because our mode of nature, we are acting. But uh, uh, how to satisfy Vishnu, one has to learn from his representative. Uh, you want to submissively ask him and if he want to engage in that way, then he can satisfy Vishnu. Otherwise, uh, he will act whimsically for his own sense gratification. Tadartham karma kaunteya mukta sangha samacharya. Osana of Kunti, perform your prescribed duties for his satisfaction. And in that way, you will always, always remain free from bondage. So that's why, but everything should be done for the satisfaction of Lord Krishna. This practice will not only save one from the reaction of work, but also gradually elevate one to the transcendental loving service of the Lord which alone can raise one to the kingdom of God. So, how to work for the uh, to satisfaction of Krishna, Jagyarthat Karmano, 
that one has to learn from a bona fide spiritual master eh, who is a pure devotee of the lord a representative and act accordingly then his life will perfect he will be able to satisfy krishna otherwise eh, he will be misguided eh? simply he act for his sense gratification then he again in the cycle of birth and death so hare krishna so any question or comment any question yes <clears throat> you mentioned prescribed duties huh? you mentioned prescribed duties one must do is it possible for a person to be a mixture of the varnas and therefore have two sets of prescribed duties oh okay 90 degrees okay yes, Nin yes. 90 degrees um you mentioned prescribed duties and i'm just wondering if a person is a mixture of varnas maybe he is a bit of brahmana and a bit of kshatriya what specifically are his duties if someone is mixture of qualities like a brahmana kshatriya mix i think yesterday also the same question was asking someone eh? in class eh? brahmana and Brahm if someone is kshatriya and brahmana mix eh? what uh, generally one is the one cast eh? according to his karma and uh, his quality his uh, there but if someone is uh, both in vaishya and khatriya eh? how it is possible that one is someone is some boy vaishya and khatriya both this is varna shankar otherwise uh, so anyhow in this age specifically in this kali yuga eh, it is uh, mentioned according to karma not by birth by by his birth is not it is not possible it is called by karma eh? in this by birth everyone is sudra and by his own karma it is uh, it is uh, uh, decided which in which caste he is belong eh? so vaishya and khatriya there is like in aita by the name uh, even in in this dynasty in jadur uh, in ispa parjanya in the this bajabasi ji in nanda maharaj he was actually eh, from the same jadu dynasty eh he is coming from this jadu dynasty and this uh, uh, and the vasudeva and nanda maharaj they are in same family eh he is khatriya but he is sursans the person vasudeva is mean is khatriya and in same dynasty is come for the parjanya is same as nanda so they are like same same family same but his khatriya is one is acting according to his act his he is born from a khatriya wife so is khatriya he from boy by so he father father is the same wife is different so by so wife then he considered as a bhishya according to his work also nand maharaj working in the bhishya like eh, to see gorakhya banij this is bhishya karma and saurya tejo dhruti dakhya yuddhe chapya palayanam these are all khatriya qualities so your question is if someone has been both qualities in khatriya quality and bhishya quality eh? i don't see such a person in any, any history that having both qualities eh? can you give any example a person having the both quality vishwamitra <coughs> vishwamitra he told about vishwamitra he was a king but after his uh, he developed the desire to become a brahmana but he has path from such a great austerity huh eh? thousand years thousands thousands of years austerity huh eh? brought to become a, become a brahmana brahmarshi huh eh? unless you exhibit the qualities sama dama tapa saucha khanti arjamaya vacha gyana vigyana astikyam how can you become brahmana eh? so vishwamitra to become a brahmana he can perform such a long austerity eh vasishtha was not recognizing me as a brahmana 
after long rest of time when he occupied these qualities then vasishta recognized yes you are a now brahman then he addressed him with mercy otherwise not eh? when he gave he gave up his khatriya nature when he is uh, come to the brahmanical platform then he want to become brahman otherwise if he, if he uh, how can he it is not so easy eh? so any question okay hari krishna